everybody thank you so much for joining me my name is Bev aka Momo B Diamond Paints I think I'm gonna change my name to Bev B Diamond Paints though I don't know I don't really like calling being called Momo no no so I think I might be changing it but anyways today I'm going to be unboxing a diamond painting from diamondart.ca yes a Canadian diamond painting company woohoo if you're new here please consider hitting that subscribe button I upload videos on a weekly basis and if you are returning here welcome back nice to see you hello your face is so beautiful you look gorgeous today anyways let's start opening up this box this is one of their more premium kits I forget what they're called but because their other canvases don't usually come in a box they usually just come uh, rolled and inside of a shipping box but this box came within a box with all the other canvases and the other canvases didn't get their own box so this one got its own box here's a look at the boxy package includes painting mud that's a new term painting mud stone diamond tray do you think it's made out of stone and oh I like this little butterfly case and then here's the other the other side of the box the back of the box instructions on how to diamond paint Ooh, it is recyclable and you can choke on this box so don't eat the box don't let your children eat the box let's take a look see so this is from diamondart.ca Canadian company I believe they're based in Ontario somewhere. I don't know where. I'm based in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. So I'm on the other side of the country from them. It did take about, I want to say, a week maybe to receive in the mail. Okay. Ooh, I love blue wax. I love it. So here is the kit. Ooh, this bag is so soft. So soft. So soft. It feels like a baby's bottom. Okay, that's gross. Um... Here's the blue wax. It comes in a nice little container. It was like bottle container. Comes with two multi placers. Amazing. This one is a seven placer. And this one is a four placer. So beautiful. And they're the good thin ones, which is amazing. Blue squishy, squish, squish. A blue pen. A nice little tray. A tray. Ooh, it's on the back. In the back it says nothing. I thought it said something here. And then sharp tweezers for you to tweeze your eyebrows with and stab yourself in the eye or the finger. Please remember to keep this on. And this is a choking hazard, so don't swallow this apparently. Don't swallow it. Okay, let's put this stuff back in the little baggie. I will be using the multiplacers and I will be using the blue wax. And the other stuff will just go in a big box of the diamond painting toolkits that I collect. Here's the, the drills. We'll look at those later. Now let's unroll this canvas. Okay, interesting. It is a small little BB canvas. Let's look. Is this what you consider a snack? Let me know. Would you consider this a snack? It is... 50 by 40 centimeters. Do you consider that a snack? I know for some people this is just the size that they work on. They don't really have snack or large size diamond paintings really. This is a good size though. I think this is a little bit more than a snack size diamond painting. I like the feel of the canvas. I like that it's poured glue. I like that on each side there are uh, schematics and there's DMC codes. Let's look at the little schematic. Schematic. Here is a thumbnail. It is two, like, I don't know, two cabin chairs with a cabin in the lake. Ooh, so Canadian. Cottage? Cottage or lake? Ca cottage or cabin? Let me know. Here is a look at the symbols. This one. Might be a little bit hard to see because it's dark on dark. I like the DMC codes though. And it's 28 colors. So from far away, 
I mean, it looks better on camera. From far away, I'll be able to tell what it is. Like, you can tell what it is. Up close, it's kind of like, looks like kind of a mess. But I'm sure that um, once I do actually complete this diamond painting, it will look pretty good. I'm thinking it will look pretty good. I'm really used to, like, the canvases where the colors are all, like, really vibrant. All the symbols stand out a lot. And, like, you can make out parts of the like what it is and on camera you can see like it's it's better it looks better on camera than in real life but I'm pretty sure this will turn out fine once it's done you can take a closer look at the drill area I don't see anything that would be super confusing um, let's look at the chairs there's some flowers, the yellow flowers. Ooh, confetti. Maybe I'll just do this whole diamond painting except for this section. Just kidding. I will I'll do the whole thing. I don't know when, but I will do it. Scan this is from diamondart.ca. Shipping, I believe. I ordered enough to get free shipping, but I believe if you just order something. Um, like one painting, I think shipping's like 15 to, <clears throat> 50 to eight, 15, wow, I can't even talk, 15 to 18 dollars, don't quote me on that, I will be doing a Canadian diamond painting video dedicated to Canadian sellers and stores, so I will figure that out for sure for you guys, yeah, overall, like, it looks good, I've seen this image or this kit on Amazon and other websites, but, yeah, Let's look at the drills now. Drills come pre-bagged in baggies. They come pre-bagged in baggies. How else should I put that? And they're numbered 1 through 28 or whatever it is. I don't, there's not going to be any ABs or special drills in this, I don't think. We can take a little gander. Well, okay. Here's my thing with drills and unboxing videos. Some people say they like seeing all the drills. Some people like seeing only the special drills. Some people don't even care about the drills. So let's meet in the middle and I'll just show you them closely through the packaging. Plus then I don't have to take them all out and try and sort them into order again. So I'm not going to take them out because I'm lazy. They look, they're round obviously. Or not obviously. Obvious. Did you know saying obviously is really rude to say? And I keep saying obviously and I don't mean it in a rude way. But this is a round kit so there's round drills. That is what I meant to say and obviously is not the right way to put it. Learn something new every day. So there's the drills. They look good to me. I mean it's really hard to screw up round drills. The bag here is labeled ATSR08. Let's see if that corresponds with anything on the canvas. ATSR08, whatever it was. Oh, there it is. So if you do keep your drills separate from your canvases, like when you're storing them, you can match them up again. I don't know. I like this canvas. I think I'm just used to like other companies like Diamond Art Club and Dreamer Designs and other companies and other canvases so opening this I'm like oh it looks funny but it it will look I think it will look nice when it's completed yeah so let me know what you guys think have you ever ordered from diamondart.ca is it a cottage or is it a cabin what do you call it I really like this I think it will be a nice little break from those huge canvases and I'll probably do this one or I'll do one of the other two that I bought from this company. If you want to watch those unboxings, I will leave them below. It's nice to see more diamond painting, Canadian, Canadian diamond painting companies. It's really nice to see more Canadian diamond painting companies. I would like to see more. It'd be cool if we got, if someone in Canada did a, a diamond painting company that sold licensed art and like licensed Canadian artists. Oh my God. I wish I had a million dollars so I could start that company. Anyways. I will talk to you guys in my next video. Again, if you're new here, please consider joining the hive by hitting subscribe. I upload videos on a weekly basis. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!